The King of Pop had many famous friends. One of them was the King of Basketball, Kobe Bryant. In this interview, Kobe tells us how Michael influenced his life. You know, Michael was uh, extremely misunderstood. Extremely misunderstood. He was just so generous, uh, extremely giving and caring. And, uh, you know, aside from us talking about work and how each other prepared and trained for, for things, aside from that, I mean, he introduced me to movies that I would never ever watch American in Paris, you know, Breakfast at Tiffany. I would never watch those movies. You know what I mean? It's like he introduced those to me, opened my eyes to a whole another side of things, and appreciate Fred Astaire's talent and things like that, and kind of seeing how that relates to basketball. And, you know, we used to have those conversations all the time. Man. He's just such a giver, and just a beautiful person. Kobe, did you know that Ron? Probably considered himself the biggest Michael Jackson fan. Did he ever talk about Michael Jackson? No, nah, no, we never talked about it. I understand that number 37, though, uh, came from uh, somebody that tweeted him, I guess, and uh, yeah. suggested the number 37 because of how many weeks Thriller was number one. So that's pretty cool. So you were always a big fan of his music, though, growing up with Michael as well? Michael Jackson? Yeah. Oh, of course. I was one of the 65 million people that bought that Thriller album. <laughs> <laughs> no question. No question. And as thousands will be gathered at Staples Center for the Michael Jackson Memorial, one of those in attendance will be Kobe Bryant. In Los Angeles, I'm Ellie Secback, reporting.